Uh, well, I think I think uh, they're very much in, intertwined. I think um, I try and live my life to a certain level and standard. I think I think you know, my own beliefs. I'm not from a particularly religious background at all, and yet my life sort of intertwined into faith and religion when I moved to Glasgow and and um, and married a. A girl from an Irish Catholic family, and uh, one of nine children, and and was taken in by the closeness of that family and the, the love and and uh, respect for each other that was there. Um, I married that <coughs> I married that young girl, and, and and we only spent a year of our lives together because she died of breast cancer, um, and yet I still am very very close to all her family. Um, after my wife's death, <coughs> I think um, faith became a very, very important part of my life for a, not a short spell, because it's always there now, it's sort of embedded, I think. it. Um, I often still talk to her and look for look for strength when I need it. Um, and, and it intertwines into my professional life, into, my, into the way I live my life, the way I try and treat everybody with respect. So in this job, times you make some very very harsh decisions with with young footballers who probably aren't going to have a career with you. Yeah. I, I try to do it in a manner that gives them encouragement and, and hope and faith.